So I'm Professor Agis, I'm a neurosurgeon in Marseille, I'm the head of the Functional Neurosurgery Department. I think what we know from radiosurgery through 25 years of practice is that when there is a lesion which is deeply seated, which is difficult for surgery, we functional risk. We know that radiosurgery is an elegant uh, solution where we can be especially safe and effective in spite of the deep location. There is clearly some of these patients who have two large lesions which are not fitting with the limit of radiosurgery. Those who are very good candidates, this is those who have small lesions which are in the hypothalamus or in the third ventricle or the floor of the third ventricle. And these patients, they have small enough lesions and usually they are very safely and efficiently treated by radiosurgery. What is the major difference of radiosurgery, in my idea, is that we are not physically, immediately destroying the lesion. We, do, we are inducing something which is more a biological response. So the disadvantage is this is taking months. So patients have to wait. They will continue to seize for several months. But when the effect is coming, this effect is coming gently, and the experience we have, and especially the prospective trial we have just published, is showing that this is very safe with very few side effects and we have observed no cognitive and no endocrinological significant side effect, which is the main limitation of the other approaches. So from a technical point of view, radiosurgery is relying on the device, we call it the gamma knife, where we are using converging beams, micro beams. We are putting a frame on the head of the patient, which is securing the uh, position of the patient and is serving as a reference. We are performing high resolution MRI, and based on this, we are elaborating a planning. And we can, and that's the beauty of radiosurgery, we can really create a plan, even if the sh shape of the target is complex. We can fit, we can be extremely conformational, and we can spare surrounding structures at risk. I, f I think the, the important point is that this is something to do as early as possible. The earlier we can do it, the better it is in terms of prevention or even reversal of, of the cognitive and psychiatric consequences.